I'm so tired. Oh, okay. I also have very weird hair today. I mean, there's just no, there's just no side. So this week, my friend Ollie is back. Um, I filmed with him a few months ago, and a lot of you said really nice things about him, so I'm glad that you all, you know, liked him and weren't dicks to him, because he's really fun to film with. So, let's do 10 reasons why you're dating a boy, not a man. One. I think when you're dating a man, you can have like proper, serious, adult, mature conversations about your relationship. Boys, you can't. I hate you! Mm, two. I think boys, generally, they just, just lose perspective on what's important in life. Tell me. What? I can't decide to play PlayStation 3 or PlayStation 4. I don't know. Three. I think when you're in like a dangerous situation, if you're kind of dating a man, you probably feel quite safe and secure. This isn't how it is with boys. Did you hear that? What? No. Yeah. I'll go have a look. You... Wait here. That... Wait here. I'm pretty sure any water comes out of that. <laughs> I just want to point out that this was not part of the sketch I wrote. Ollie didn't know there was anything in that gun. Or... I think why it's fun to date a man is that you kind of expect them to have really cool pimping flats. Boys don't. So here we've got the, uh, the couch and kitchen in one. Oh, so... Oh, okay. Uh, where, where do you cook stuff? I don't really understand. Oh. Five! Don't you think... Don't you think it's really sexy when a man is really intellectual, you know, he loves reading and his bookshelf is just you know, full of good, great, intellectual books. Do polar bears get lonely? Oh, <laughs> six. This is what happens when a man takes you out for food. We'll see you then. Right, restaurant's booked for 7.30. I've got a cab coming at seven. Uh, we should be done by 9.30. Yeah. Back here, nightcap, done. Great night out. Okay. Don't think about anything, I've planned it. Aww. And this is what happens when a boy takes you out for food. EFC, perfect fried chicken, next door. Seven! He probably still dreams of being a rapper. I used to go to school. <laughs> it was pretty lame. I'd come home at the end of the day and put on my game. Peace. <laughs> Eight. He'll probably treat you a lot like his mum. Okay, and this is... Oh, it's not the kitchen. Yeah, yeah, yeah but nice. brand new. Washing machine, so yeah, okay. Maybe you wanna well, get acquainted, um, and uh, yeah, yeah, um, I'm just gonna go and sit over there. I think nine boys are always drunk. This is my shrine to nights out. Yeah. Getting hammered. Yeah. Oh. This off an Australian tourist. It's a cane toad money purse. Oh, that's. I was absolutely rat ass when I got that. That's so useful. Oh, scary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Um, oh. Oh God. Ibiza. And ten. And finally, the boy you're dating more than likely lives with his parents. Oh, what a lovely, what a lovely lounge. How nice is it? Just be quiet, oh. yeah. Sorry, you're, you're, oh, you, you've got flatmates. No. Sorry. My mum and dad, they made this lounge room. They're just actually asleep back there. I'm going to get a condom. Um, be fine, just be quiet. Where, be quiet. Yeah? Where, where are you getting a condom from? Just mum. Uh, fucking hell. Right, so, there you have it, we've, you know, cleared that one up, I hope you all feel, you know, a lot wiser and smarter, you know, after this week's very highbrow topic. Massive thank you to Ollie for um, helping me out, he was great, um, he works at a ping pong place called Bounce, which is amazing, if you live in London go check it out, it's awesome. He does videos for them, so I will leave all the links down below, they're really funny, so check them out. So thanks to Caroline the cat. Uh, I don't know why I'm thanking her, but um, cheers, Kaza. Anyway, I hope you all have a good week. Um, I'm really tired. I'm going to have to go and have a shower and then watch Orange is the New Black because I'm obsessed with it. This is a good look for me, isn't it? I'm talking shit. Bye. They have a very normal relationship, as you can see. <laughs> <laughs> No, I think that's overkill. I think I think you're nailing it as it is actually. <laughs>
This will do the microphone, won't it? <laughs> Oh my god, I have to watch that back. <laughs> that is so funny.